Hello everybody, this is Robotnik is Sexy with a video of me fighting Kipper93 from YouTube. Um, the Pokemon battler we all know and love, actually. I think he's kind of obscure. And he is from Poland, which is awesome. Poland is a cool place, I guess. I've never been there. And I actually have fought this guy before. Um, uh, I totally got hosed um, due to a lot of hacks, but I uh, I uh, still recorded the thing. And um, I'm gonna put our first battle in the link below. So as you can see, I led with my beloved neckbeard, and I killed his. Toxicrope guy who popped my balloon, which is no good for me, because I uh, kind of need my balloon, and I make a really, really horrible play here. I predict a water move, but he was actually um, predicting my switch, and he thought I was going to go into um, Pringles, so he used Dragon Pulse, so that that horrible thing play that I did cost me in Hydrogon, who is oftentimes my ace in the hole because he's like my uh, preferred revenge killer. But anyway, uh, so I have to go into Scar Mark II here. I uh, leech seed his uh, his fan Rotom, who uh, burns me, which is kind of annoying. Um, get out Nido King here, and uh, instead of switching into Jellicent like I probably should have, I want to pop his balloon and see how much Thunderbolt is going to do, and unfortunately that is going to cost me a Nido King. So, the match has already just begun, and two of my Pokemon have been uh, obliterated. Um, so that's, uh, that's uh, bad. Um, I do predict his knockoff, strangely, and go into Neckbeard, um, and I try to predict him switching into Heatran, but instead, he goes into Kingdra, but Kingdra takes a crit, and uh, the crit did matter, um, there was actually quite a lot of hacks on his side, but um, then again, that's Pokemon. Um, I uh, basically go into Scar Mark II as a meat shield, and, um, you know, it's a pretty good special wall, so, I mean, the only thing I can really do is leech seed this Rotom, though, um, which is kind of terrible. I try to protect here, no idea that he would switch, and uh, I make the very wise choice of switching into Pringles now. If I did not save... Uh, Ferrothorn for later, I probably wouldn't have won, um, because his leech seed comes in very, very handy. Um, his Ella Ella the Evilite Tangela is really, really hurting, because I got the burn on it, and its health is going down, and, uh, predict the switch nicely into Rotom. I was kind of hoping for Heatran, but this Rotom works too. I just leave Skarmark 2 in as Death Fodder. I was... I don't know why I didn't protect. I, I kind of felt it was pointless. Um, and I go into Gigas here, and he knows exactly what my Gigas does. I think because he's seen some of my videos, which is the first time I've ever been able to say that out loud, and uh, so, yeah, this Spear Tomb is very, very, it's pretty much all mind games. You have to know what they're going to do, and if you can't figure out what they're going to do, you're just going to get um, your ass kicked, basically. So, yeah, so Spear Tomb is now... Um, totally worthless. I uh, have to go into Pringles. I don't really have a choice. But uh, Ferrothorn's uh, Leech Seed is going to save the day, basically. Um, 
I'm trying to skull burn and I don't really get it, but it's alright, because I have Leech Seed steadily damaging this um, Fan Rotom. And um, the Thunderbolt really isn't doing that much, and I can just recover spam, and uh, with leftovers and Leech Seed, I can get a ton of health, and, uh, and it, you know, it's kind of a dickish, stalling thing to do, but it's really the only thing I could do other than, like, forfeit the match or, um, yeah, basically, it's the only smart move I could do, and, um, I, I really feel that, uh, he, my opponent, would have done the same thing, so it's, it's no big deal. Um, as you can see, Rotom is wearing down, um, this is kind of a stallish thing, which is why I doubled speed here. Uh, well, I doubled speed for the whole thing, um, but, uh, yeah, anyway, Rotom is finally going to fall to the Leech Seed damage, which is basically all Ferrothorn does. Ferrothorn puts on some Leech Seed, and it hands out huge recoil damage with its ability and item, and that's pretty much what Ferrothorn does. And it also blocks certain attacks and, you know, etc. Um, I get really, really lucky and get a burn on him. Um, but the burn uh, doesn't quite matter a whole lot, because I do have Neckbeard, although... If I hadn't burned his scissor, he might have switched into Heatran here, which would have been devastating for me. I was really on pins and needles at this point in the match, because if he had switched into Heatran and not allowed me to speed boost, I could not outrun Heatran and he would just earth power me, and that would be game over, basically. Because, uh... Yeah, my spear tomb is, is totally crippled, but uh, luckily uh, he lets me speed up, and that is going to be a mini Embor sweep, and good game, Adam, and uh, see ya.